When I became the digital minister of Taiwan two and a half years ago, I wrote a prayer as my job description. It goes like this. When we see the internet of things, let's make it an internet of beings. When we see virtual reality, let's make it a shared reality. When we see machine learning, let's make it collaborative learning. When we see user experience, let's make it about human experience. And whenever we hear the singularity is near, let us always remember the plurality is here. Digital democracy to me promises the potential of extending the plurality, not just about association of human beings like legal corporate personhood, but also legal natural personhood through inexpensive IoT devices we're already seeing around the world, from New Zealand to India, people attributing the indigenous lands, the rivers, and so on, and accredit them personhood. This is, I think, a very novel way of us regarding the natural spirits and making sure that whatever decision that we make as a society, we do not create externalities that are negative to the environment as a result. And I think the digital technologies can really help by making everybody a participant into this global consciousness of a shared environment. And only when the rivers and the mountains are also included in the plurality of democracy, can we truly create a sustainable democracy that includes everyone on the planet, whether they're human beings or rivers or mountains.